You see indoor track and field set to head to the national championships in Fayetteville, Arkansas. Now joined by head coach Susan Seaton and coach, a, a successful season for your team. Uh, you've got four athletes heading to the national championships out of a total of seven in the American Athletic Conference. You have more than the rest of the conference combined. It's been a good year for you. Yes, it's uh, very exciting uh, to take a big group to the indoor national championship in Fayetteville. Uh, we worked extremely hard uh, to get to that point and uh, kudos to our athletes and coaches that made this all happen. I know it was uh, a bit of a disappointment for, for you and your team not to be able to have conference championships this year, but to your credit and your athletes' credit, uh, they, they just kept working hard, they kept battling, and, and this is a good reward for their efforts as they continue to, to work hard all season. Absolutely. Yes. Uh, you know, we had to overcome some extra diversity, not just pandemic COVID related, but also uh, having the conference championship canceled by the uh, conference office uh, was a was a big, uh, you know, uh, a little bit of a of a disappointment for our athletes and coaches. But they responded well and kept battling. And, uh, you know, we're always trying to get around obstacles in our way and focus on, you know, what's down the road, what can we actually accomplish and try to stay very positive. And so I think that mindset for the whole team to just uh, deal with adversity in a positive way has really shown big time. Uh, they just kept battling all the way until the end. And uh, I think the result is uh, four outstanding athletes, uh, very strong uh, uh, you know, uh, individual rankings for, for most of them uh, going to the NCAA championship to re represent our team and our school. As you said, uh, it's been a, a successful season. Uh, your four athletes uh, rank very high heading into these uh, indoor championships. Your men's team ranked number 21 in the nation. So a lot of high expectations and uh, a lot of good vibes heading into this one. Well, Coach, we appreciate your time. Uh, we'll be following you and uh, the Bearcats in Fayetteville and best of luck. Thank you and go Bearcats.